These are the hands of the man who calls himself the world's fastest escapologist. He is Alan Allen, a 24-year-old Manchester magician who in a Surrey garden marks the 25th anniversary of the death of his hero, Houdini, in a way the master himself wouldn't have dared. For Mr. Allen is to be buried alive and attempt an escape from the one thing Houdini said made escape impossible, the grave. The time is 11.30. The grave is filled in. Six feet and half a ton of earth, its weight increased by the dampness, are between escape man Allen and the cool November air. A signal rope, which is attached around his body, is his only contact with his helpers. Minutes tick by. Something's gone wrong. No signal has come. Dig him out is the order, and the shovels begin to fly again. They've got to work fast to avert disaster. Two feet down, bare hands have to take over, for the shovels may hurt the man whose escape bid went wrong. Thirty-eight minutes after setting out on what he promised would be the world's greatest escape, Alan Allen is free, alive and sound. But only just. Alan, who claims he's done this trick twice before, says he failed because the earth was stamped down too hard. He'll try it again soon. Some people think he should give up gambling with death. But he can't. It's his living.